everything, sir. Sir, please, I'm not in a good spirit. What seems to be the matter, my dear? Sir, there is no what I hear. There is no what I hear. I discussed about this yesterday with you, sir. My apologies, dear one. You slip my mind entirely. You don't have a spare container to keep your water. Sir, I don't. I don't have anything. It's fine, it's fine, sir. Thank you, sir. I, I will manage the one I have, but please, just try. Fortunately, Mrs. Duke has not embraced the um, classroom with her presence yet. Thanks the heaven. <sighs> Why the gratitude? Besides, she loves you. And I guess she possesses a bit of charm. Spare me. Hmm? Perhaps I'm merely favored, you know. And the educators here seems to hold me on a high standard. Do <sighs> you get that? What is the matter, hmm? I think she has continued her customary glancing at me. As if I, I have tampered with her snacks or something. <laughs> oh, she was the best student before your arrival. Besides, you will soon know her behavior. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Um, please, um, can you help me with um, your assignment? I did not finish my due to time constraints. Please. I, I will help you. Let's just go. Thank you. <laughs> Beginning to wonder how you're even able to afford this type of a phone. Let me guess. She either stole it or she traded her body for it. <laughs> well, I wish I knew who bestowed this beautiful, awesome phone upon me. <laughs> I don't understand. Are you trying to be sarcastic with me or what? Look, little brat, we did not come here to banter words with you, okay? Truly, Joy. A dispatch rider just delivered this to me as a gift from an anonymous benefactor. I'm not my landlord, as you think. I just wish they can review or show me the identity of the individual. Look. As corny as you think you may be, you fail to realize that we are not here for levity. Since you are here to respond to nonsensical replies. <laughs> I mean, regardless. I, I don't have time for all this bullshit. I came here to warn you. Personally, I'm not in your class or your level. But I am going to bring my so amazing and beautiful self down to your level and class. And I'm here to warn you. I overheard you and Miriam gossiping with my name today in class. If I ever, and I mean ever, Catch the winds of my name in this stupid mouth of yours. <laughs> You're going to live to regret the day you came into this school. And have you forgotten that I also observe your penchant feet on gossip? Huh? Oh, wow. <laughs> the little brat has got to talk back at me now. Oh, you have the guts to talk back at me. Now, listen and listen very attentively. This is a freaking school. And I can as much as choose where I'd like to feed my eyes, my mouth, and my ears. You don't have any right whatsoever to tell me where and how to do that, okay? Today is a very lucky day. Another time, girls, let's go. Let's go. Yes. Just like that. Yes, for me too. Let's go. Please. Ah. Mm -hmm. 
Have a package from your spouse. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> but, sir, can I ask you a question? I, I'm sorry, Ogogo. If it's about the identity of the one that keeps sending this to you, I am sorry. I am bound not to reveal the identity. I shall be going now. Bo, sir. I mean, I am so going to deal with that girl. We're going to deal with her. Like, I can see the way she walks around the school like she's the owner of the school. Mm -hmm. I mean, now that I remember, what's that? I don't understand what you and Teacher Nelson are doing. <laughs> oh, come on, Joy. I wasn't telling you that on the basis of a more list. I don't understand. So, what are you trying to say? I mean, I kind of like it. You needed to see the way he cursed me. Ha! Ah, that man is too sweet. Joy, you're a Christian. Try to ask. Oh, spare me that. He's too so sweet. Ha! Ah. is married. Married man, Joy. I mean, I didn't make advances first. He came to me. Both of you have really discussed. Oh, please. Let's go on. How are you doing? Huh? How are you? You look good. Hey, Kelvin. Hey, Chris. What's up? Hey, Joker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've seen your man. Okay. I'm still letting you Hey, Joy. Hey, Joy. Kelvin, what's with the formalities? What do you mean, what is the formality? This is cool now. We are in school. Let's at least be formal here. See, it's not, it's not a big deal. Okay. Oh, now you know we're in school. Kelvin, when you're constantly eating me out in the school toilet, you do, you do not remember we're in school. You, you, you're not coming here to be formal. Leave me alone. You're coming here to, to, to be formal with me. We're in school. <coughs> I'll, I'll meet you in class, John. Right. When you're eating me out in the school toilet, no, 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 I'm not going to talk. No, no, no. I had a dream last night. A dream? Hope it's a good one, Papa. I had a dream where the gods struck the priestess with an incurable disease. God forbid. But Papa, why would the gods strike the priestess with an incurable disease? I have been a seer in this kingdom for the past 30 years. And I have never had any vision from the gods without it coming to pass. That is why your father is so much in deep worry. It has never happened before, except once before my birth. An arrogant priestess took the mantle of leadership from the priestess that was recognized by the gods. And she was struck with an incurable disease. From there, she died. Oh, Kobolombe! Does that imply that she's not the rightful priestess? But Abu got drowned in the river while fetching water, as we are being told. 
Perhaps, just perhaps, she might be alive somewhere. The gods shall still locate her wherever she is. What if she does not accept who she is and come back home to me? <laughs> Every rightful priestess bears a significant mark on their part of their body. It usually starts from a mild scratch which turns to painful bones and the pain shall increase till she can't take it anymore. I see herself return back to us. I believe if she's still alive, the gods might have started sending her their messages. Hold on, man. hold on, hold on, hold on. Baba never in doubt. Sit down. I should be on your <laughs> Of course, you let it down. Yes. <laughs> yes. Look who's choosing to embark on the discussion. Bro. <laughs> I can't believe I am out of this. This is practically unfair. Oh, God. I've been outstanding for the past two years. And for the fact, instead of giving. An opportunity to some of our colleges. An opportunity to make me younger. Mm. See, hold it on. I understand how you feel. Okay? See, I'm very close to our coordinator. So uh, I, I could help you talk to him on your behalf. Really? Yes, I'm sure 100%. Do it for me. I'll do it for you. Oh, and I, I, I know that my joy, my joy, my girlfriend will make it also to the excursion. But wait, 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 Kelvin, Kelvin. How sure are you that you can do that? Oh, yes, I can because I know myself and my girlfriend. See, listen, that young lady is the most brilliant girl in her class. As a matter of fact, that girl is one of the biggest girls in this school. If K is not taken, that girl will be the first person to be on this game. Hey, hey, guys, I think we are getting it for lectures. So let's go, let's go, let's shoot, go. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Bro, come on now. Come on, Joe. Ah. Ah. Oh, what do you mean? Why are you dragging me like that? You're hurting me. I swear, you know that's not your best. I don't even know what's wrong with you. Huh? You don't even know the reason why I dragged you here. You're already complaining. Meanwhile, I've been heard about the excursion and the other things. Oh, that. I mean, baby, you're such a show off. I saw your name on the list now. I'm so proud of you. Congratulations. I pray, please shut up. Oh. I and Shegu were chosen for Chooks. They did not select Chooks. So, me, I want to nah, I want to visit the office of the coordinator to know if I can grab him some cash. Mm -hmm. Like, I can give Chooks a spot. You get? Uh, so did I saw the question meant for your class. Yes. Four people have to be chosen for the discussion. Oh. See. Take this. Look. Here. I can't send this to you for security reasons, alright? Yes, I can't send it to you. So you have to memorize it very well so that you can get a high score alongside with your friends. Oh my god! <laughs> Baby, you're so sweet. You're the best boyfriend in the whole world. What? Every other one that comes up. I love you, baby. I love you so much. I love you. I love you. I love you. So you're happy no, no you. other man can take your place in my heart. This heart belongs to you. I like you. You're happy. <laughs> thank you, baby. I'm so happy. Thank you so much. So you have to quickly go and remind you very well, okay? Of course, maybe. I trust you, know, even parents. Oh, I'm going to treat you something. Go, Joe, tell me. Thank you. Thank you, baby. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so this test is supposed to last for just 30 minutes. Alright? Four of you will be chosen to participate in this government
funded excursion. Now, awards and cash prizes will be given after the excursion. I expect it to be in your best behavior. Now, if for any reason I find you doing some kind of magu magu, I'll penalize you and it's not going to be funny for you. Right? Yes, sir. Okay, so uh, your time starts now. Yes, young lady, why are you moving your head frantically? Sir, I thought I had my name. I'm sorry, sir. You thought you had your name? What kind of excuse is that one? You're just looking for what to copy from. My friend, will you focus on your uh, paper? They should have given us enough time. <laughs> I don't understand. I mean, that shouldn't be an excuse. <sighs> yes, the time they gave was limited. Well, at least you should make use of the one they gave to you. <sighs> so, how was it for you? Hope you did well. I finished the whole question. Just so lucky, my dear. Have you seen Ogoko? Oh, yeah, I think I saw her mirror upstairs. It's unfortunate I'm out of the race. No, it's not. Before the results out. Well, well, well. Look who we have here. Look, you have been a very hard item to find. Why are you bullying her? What have she done to deserve all this? Oh, shut up, you filthy rat. Do not call me that. Look at how poverty is moving around you, you cheap thing. It's okay, Mira. You know, let's hear what our visitors have for us, okay? You know, personally, I don't like to stress myself and I don't really have time to exchange words with you or this beauty brat called Miriam and you know I believe action speaks louder than words and I don't have time for all this bullshit both of you are doing I came here because I observed the way you were spinning your neck around in the class looking for where to copy from I'm very sure the gods of your land left you today <laughs> you copy cards thing. <clears throat> well I don't know what makes you think that you are better than everyone I mean, if you pass the exercise, you should go home and celebrate your victory. Right? How dare you talk? Ah! How dare you? Eh, eh. If you <laughs> touch you me, I go make sure I go come out all the teeth where in your mouth. Come on, come on for this. Shut get out. Stop. Get out. I say make you get leave. out. Leave. She said leave. Are you not hearing? I go dismantle this your fine face. So Shut. come out for here. You don't want to come out. Come out for here. Oh, it's your idea. Come now. Come. You dare create. I mean, so this one is follow talk. You don't even see our face. Oh, you bought picking. Hey, Mira, sorry, good afternoon. Yes, what is it? Uh, uh, sorry now, uh, are we quarreling? Why are you attitude? Have I done anything wrong to you? State whatever you want to say, please, let me leave here. Fine, I have been looking for my joy ever since, and the last guy I asked say he saw her along this side. Please, have you seen her? Well, your joy is upstairs bullying my friend Okuwa, and you are here asking me silly questions. Where is my babe? What? What? Oh my god, what? Joy? No. When, when, when did she become a brie? Well, you can go upstairs and ask her yourself. Rubbish. <laughs> you actually think you can <laughs> mess with me in this school and go sports free? You hear mad? You stop me who I be? Look at this thing, oh! Imagine. Stand up and forgive you. I just do my You want to mess with me? Stand Stand up. Up. <laughs> What? You, 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 you,
you. No. Are you actually taking the side of this idiot? It's not my side of your girlfriend! Have I touched you before? Have I dealt with you before? And you, you, you stand here, watch her, hit her. Oh, I mean, it's not safe here. What the hell have you done to you? At you. How dare you talk to me like that in front of my friend? In a while! Listen, let me tell you something. I, no, I don't think you have seen or noticed the thought of my anger issues. Please, I don't want to hit you. If you dare touch her again, then I'll not tell you the kind of things I've made up. Don't try to do Marifi in a mail. Kelvin, me! Marifi in a mail. Kelvin, me! Because of this thing! Sorry, don't mind me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't mind me. You're taking sides with this brat, Kelvin! Kelvin! Marifi, the male. You don't want to eat me. Kelvin, you don't want to eat me. Because of this thing, Kelvin. I can't believe Kelvin took her sight. That was quite embarrassing. Ha! I mean, can you people even imagine? Imagine my boyfriend taking the side of that brat over mine! I swear to God, I'm going to deal with that girl in this school! Just calm down. Relax, girls. I mean, you don't even understand. That girl keeps getting under my skin and she's irritating! You can't just get worked on that stupid girl for Google. Even her name saves sounds word. They will so post it on the notice board, the result will soon come out. You know me so well. The only reason why I'm trying to be calm is because you're asking me to lose. Please, let's go and check on the notice board, please. Yes, let's go. Okay. Yeah, send me to you. If you don't worry, I don't know why you're bothered about that. Listen, this thing is just very easy for us to have a mm -hmm. So there's nothing to stress you about. Okay? So we just have to. Focus and get it. I mean, why? What happened yesterday? Kelvin. Ah, uh, <laughs> my ma. Kelvin. Ma. Ah, my my Kelvin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to thank you, but thank you so much. Thank you for standing up for me. I mean, you're such a nice person. I'm done with you. Um, I'll go go. I did what I must do for you, I guess. But how come I, all these things I've been doing in this squad? I don't, I don't know. Hmm? Like, why can't you stand out for yourself and defend yourself in this school? Do you know? Do you know these people have been molesting you? And for a while now, you keep quiet. So you don't want to do anything about it. Kevin, you won't understand. I mean, my life has been so so complicated. You know, when I try to retaliate, the consequences are much. What do you mean by that? No worry about that. I'm fine. I mean, I'll be fine. Oh, go, go, listen to me. I know you're not fine. Hmm? But particularly, I know you're just trying to be cool, but you're not cool. Listen, I'm here now, right? Yeah, whatever thing you need, anything at all you want, just call me. Don't forget to call me. Just call me for assistance. I really need. I know what you're passing through, so I can't just think what you have Right? Leave your legs. Here you go, ma'am. Thank you so much. You're welcome. But please, sir, can you please reveal the identity of the individual that have been doing this? I mean, this is too much already. Eh? I was only left with the landlord number. I mean, when I went for a walk and came back, I saw attires, provisions, and other things. Like, can you please? I really need to express my kind gratitude to him, please. Ma, I'm sorry. I regret to inform you that I am bound by confidentiality. I cannot reveal the sender address to you. I apologize. Thank you. But, but sir.
All right, so this is why I called you. It's concerning the discussion. So, guess what? Your scores are tied. You understand? You are both, uh, you both scored seven to five marks each. Wow. And only one of you will go for that discussion. So, in order to ensure that it's a fair assessment, so I had to organize a, just a verbal quiz for the both of you. All right? You okay, understand? Sir. Okay, sir. Okay. So, Agugwa, I think, let me uh, ask you the first question. What is the botanical name for cassava? Money holds uh, Esculanta. <laughs> Excellent. Very good. And now, for the next question. Who created the new Nigerian national anthem? I mean, I'm so scared. I don't want that girl to image victorious in that test. Eh? If she come and start spoiling things for me, let's hope for the best. Let's hope for the best because I can't even imagine myself seeing going on an excursion with her. Ah, that just vexes me. I cannot even stand that little brat. Eh? Ha. Especially seeing Kelvin around her makes me want to cry. What did she even give to Kelvin? Hmm. Ha! Okay. Well, we're going to. We shall see. I'm very, very sure I came to this school first before her, so we'll see. Don't worry. I'm going to deal with her in this room. I'm going to deal with her. Calm down, calm down. You're my friend. Google, you start with me. Apologies, Kelvin. I know I saw you seated there as I passed by, so it felt like greeting. <laughs> that is very kind of you. Hmm? Thank you. You seem elected. What has happened? Well, I was selected for the excursion. Really? Honestly. <laughs> Impressive. I never knew you had it in you. Um, Possibly, uh, we will meet then at the location. Mm -hmm. Sure. Really? Sure. <laughs> See you there. All right. See you. I mean, sir, I'm only concerned about her. All I'm saying is, this is her first year in this school, and I'm not sure she has ever been to any excursion before. I don't want anything to happen to her, that's why. And I don't want her to encounter wild animals. Please consider what I'm saying. Wild animals? Yes, sir. Anyway, I understand what you're saying, but you also have to consider the fact that she beat Oluchi in that test, that short squeeze. See, we operate on transparent and impartial decisions here, all right? So. Uh, um, um, but, sir. Oluchi has been a very smart and intelligent student in this school all this while. Mm. I, I, I think Oguko should not be allowed to just come in and take us. visa. Please just give her a chance to come with us. Please just consider what I'm saying. So now I see what's actually happening here. You're not bothered about, you know, wild animals attacking her. There is no form of empathy. All those things you mentioned about wild animals are just shenanigans. You're just talking out of selfish desires to ensure that your colleague gets the slot for the excursion. You are even nodding your head. My friend, get out of this office. Get out of here now. Papa. My daughter. What is the problem? You look worried. 
a day I never wished to witness in my life. I just come to my presence. I don't understand, Papa. The priestess has just been struck with hey. an illness. Hey, Papa? Just like you are pretty dead, oh. Yes! Hey. I told you. I told you that for the past 30 years, the gods have never shown me anything in dream. And it did not come to pass. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, I have sent messages across the elders so that they can assemble. So that we can get to the root of this predicament. Because if it is not done, we all will suffer the consequences. I don't think. See, we only have this five here. Mm -hmm. So we are looking for this thing. So we should just add the number one. And use the five to get this thing. Kelvin! Oh, wow. So this is what it has gotten to. You're not rolling with this little brat. Joy. What? You can't just enter here and start backing at her. What is wrong with you? Hey, shut up. I should what? You should shut up. Kelvin, what is wrong with you? Why are you all around this, this little brat? Excuse me, who do you call a rat? Of course I'm calling you a rat, you shameless orphan. What the fuck are you doing with my man? Thank the goodness that this is a dream. Eh? But I'm having this feeling that something is going to happen. I feel like I must be wrong. I thought as much. Hmm? Oh, go, go. Where will you have found if not here? Sitting outside, really. All to yourself. As you are. Mm -hmm. But Kevin, come to think of it, don't you think Joy, your girlfriend, will be mad at me if she finds out how close you are getting to me? <laughs> oh, Google, you worry too much. Hmm? Did I remind you that this is my life and nobody have the right to live my life for me? It's my life, remember? Alright? So the point now is... <coughs> Tomorrow, we are all going for the discussion in the morning. So that was the point. And the school is closed for today. Yeah. So stand up. Let's go. Spirit took hold of me today and I end up hurting Olama. My daughter, I forgot to tell you that gods are cruel sometimes. Hmm? You can only control it by not being angry or by singing this song.
What is the meaning of this? Sorry. Something wrong with you? Sorry. I will throw that phone inside the bush now. Sorry, sir. All right. We're going to the second phase of our government-funded excursion. Um, we're going to just have a little recess. You can rest under that tree. Yes, some good tree. Uh, with some good trees. Now you can only um, cure this with a certain type of fertilizer with a with a um, that's H two C H two C O O H uh, form of um, you know chemicals. Yes, you get yes. the point. Yeah. All right. So just like we told them. Now look at this other uh, tree. Now this is um, palm wine. Coconut tree. I just hope there is no coconut so that it won't fall on our head. Now, um, oh, jokes. Honestly, um, I'm, I'm amazed with what I'm seeing here. Yes. You know, I'm crushing hard. Um, Oluchi. But it's so sad that she did not make it here. And that is because of the new queen in town. Or Google. Yeah. I even heard that she beat Oluchi 10 answer to 4. She's so brilliant. Yes, I I believe you. You know, she's brilliant. Yes. She's intelligent, elegant, whatever. But come to think of this. What do you think about Kelvin and his new girl? I can see sadness, bitterness in that girl's eyes. Do you think they broke up or something? I think you should go to her and ask. <laughs> Choose at times you behave as if you are not my friend. Instead of uh, you no, to no, answer no, no, me, no, no, you are here. I'm giving them my own direction now. Oh yeah, go on, come, let's go. I mean... This girl is so annoying. I just want to strangle her with my bare hands. Why can't she not just leave my man alone? Come on, Joy, calm down. But the rumors had it that you both broke up. And at times, rumors appear as real. Huh? Yeah. We broke up. Who told you that? I and my man were just having a little bit of misunderstanding. And instead of that idiot to come and reconcile with me, he's there fornicating around that girl. Wait, guys. I think I have a plan. Come. She's so smart. Do it. Ah, let's go. And you have the most beautiful smile ever. Please stop flattering me, Kel. Ah, you think so? I'm not flattering you. I'm just telling the honest truth. But look, after we are done here in this forest, I'm coming to your place. Well, that's a nice idea, but. But what? You know, comfortable with it. There's something I would like to tell you, Kerry. Oh, interested. So, why am I here? Oh, yeah. I'm here to hear you out. It doesn't exist in the fact that I have feelings for you. Yes. Kevin, I'm not ordinary. Hmm? I'm not someone you can fall in love with. Honestly, I know you may not understand, but my life has been a mystery. No, he's dead was not ordinary. I mean, I'm a priestess in my village. And <laughs> we are not being chosen by blood, by voting, or by election. We are being chosen through our mother's womb. So, <clears throat> I'm the successor. I need to go back to my village and worship the cause. Well, I, I don't really know how I found myself in the city, but my father's death, too, was not ordinary. He was struck with a death spirit, and they sent evil people and killers to kill me. Like, I don't know. Look, um, I will go. It is fine, all right? It is fine. I. I know I can not help you, but at least I can help at the same time. Okay? You are safe. Hmm? <laughs> I'm 
not from this city. I'm from a very far village. I know everything seems complicated, right? I don't even know where to start and how to start selling. Listen, I'll go. You just have to be free with me. Just open up, okay? There's nothing I cannot understand. I know. I know how it feels to be in pain. Open up to me. Never met my mom. She died during this childbirth. I mean, it's have been just my dad taking care of me till now. Before that mysterious day. My dear. I already understand how you feel, trust me. I do. I have not lost any of my family, or siblings. But I still understand how you feel to be in pain. His death was not so bad. <laughs> I see your mother come home. Please, 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 So that's how it happened. I mean, I don't know how I found myself in a house in a city. Like, I also found a book written with the landlord name and his number. With some items, my school uniform and other things. And there is always this mistress man who always send gifts to me through a dispatch rider. You know, I've always asked and begged him to please reveal the identity of this individual, but he refuses. Like, Kevin, my life is just a mystery. <laughs> One thing is for sure. Everything will be alright. Okay? Yes, can you imagine? Just see now. He looks so happy talking to her. He's really forming a big bond with her. Eh? Joy. Joy. I don't know why you're still wasting time on this girl. My plan is perfect. Let's terminate this girl. Ha! Angela. Angela. I think it's high time we go ahead with your plan. We we'll teach this girl a lesson she will never forget in her Just life. Just do it immediately. She's really getting under my skin. Girls, let's leave this place. You see, that's why I don't react to bullings and insults. I mean, when the spirit gets possession of me, it enters my body and soul, and I, 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 I might react. So, I think I should tell you this now. Joy is getting to my nerves and I must react. No, you just have to take it easy on her, okay? She will come along sometimes. Hey, take it easy Kevin, on. what's up? Hey. hey, what's up? Angela, how are you? Fine. Please, can you escort me go with myself? I'm scared to go off alone. I don't get it. I mean, can't you go yourself? Please, no, go, go. I'm scared to go off alone. Please. Let's go down. I don't understand. Eh? Agogo, 
Like I don't understand. So when you're busy swarming around with people's boyfriend, you didn't know there would be consequences. Huh? Ah! You little whore. How dare you? How dare you wrap your filthy hands all around my man? Mm -hmm. Are you crazy? Now listen to me. Trust me, I am going to make life so miserable for you. Mm -hmm. so Prostitute. You haven't heard joy. I mean, you need to be very careful with people who are kind, calm, and quiet in front of abuse. For the last time, Joy, don't hurt me. I mean, <laughs> do you want the consequences to be story? I'm shaking. I'm peeing. Consequences. Idiot. <laughs> How dare you? You said tell Papa she talks. You never lie. <laughs> For the last time, Christine. If he hurts me again, eh? What's going to happen to you? You won't like it. Oh, shut up already! You little brat! Let's face, please. I cannot it's continue it's again. It's so, <laughs> okay, I understand. Maybe they are trying to scale us. Oh. <laughs> Angela is dead. Dead? Yes. Angela, she's dead. Mm -hmm. How? What happened? And where is your Google? You left her behind. She could have the problem. Ogugo killed Angela. She's a witch. And it starts. God able to appear and disappear. The disappearing part is part of the mystery. Oh, she killed innocent Angela. And now shooks. I cannot still wrap my head around all this thing happening. Like, she cannot just start killing people like that. She doesn't even like look like a witch. Hopefully I make it out here alive. So, we cannot we, we cannot even Find out what can you do? What can you do? I just say, which can you appear? What is it? What is wrong with you? Why are you looking at me like that? Joy, you disgust me. Kelvin, how dare you? Kelvin, how dare you put all this on me? This is all your fault because if you did not start your ungodly relationship with that girl and making me look like a mock in front of everyone, I will not be bullying her. Listen, Joy, your bullying did not start when I developed feelings for her. Did you understand what I'm saying? So I don't know what all this is coming from. Kelvin, you are simply a sim and a fool and a very big fool at like that. You know what? I'm not surprised you're still defending that witch and that murderer over me, your girlfriend. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Listen, that, that girl that you're, that you're talking to like that, she's a priestess. Joy, you see that girl? She serves a 
a spirit, a deep bloody spirit living inside of her that tells her control her actions. I, I, I don't understand spirits. Don't understand. How? Spirits care. You don't understand. Now let me explain myself again to you. That young lady or Gogo serve a living goddess. You guys started bullying her, distracting her studies. That, see, the spirit became angry. Hey, Shagun, come and see. I'm looking for Kelvin and Ogogo. And Angela, have you seen them? Sir, I couldn't find Kelvin and Ogogo either. I think I saw you with Christine. You guys paid. Where is she? Where is she now? Answer me. Uh, you, you, you should we have to do. I'm, I'm going back to the school. Uh, sir, I killed her. You killed what? Hey, see, Shagun. Are you. Uh, I, is this a prank? I killed Chrissy. Sir. Hey, 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 calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. Wait, uh, you may be joking, but I need you to relax, all right? Hey, okay, okay, let's, let's assume that you actually killed her, all right? Hey, hey, Shagun, you don't have to hurt yourself. Oh, that okay. evil witch made me kill Christy. Evil witch, all right, all right, yes. Uh, uh, hey, just calm down, let's, let's go, let's go back. I cannot let's... live with this guilt, Let me sir. Take, I feel like killing myself. Let me take you to the boss. Hey, Shagun, Shagun, eh? relax. <laughs> Come here, Shagun. Come, let's go. Shagun! Hey, Shagun, Shagun, Shagun! <laughs> Listen, I recently knew. She just told me some hours ago before we got inside here. Oh, but we, we never tried to murder her. I just wanted to teach her some lessons so she could stay away from my man. Your friends, everybody about you. See, you guys are trying to murder that girl. So her action is not ordinary. Do you understand what I'm saying? So we should just see, Joy. That ugly girl, she's a, an, she's a nice girl, okay? You guys started bullying her and the spirit inside of her became angry with you guys. You guys already made the spirit angry. Very soon, hmm. very soon, very soon, they will come for you. And what makes you think when she's coming for me, she's not coming for you too? Or do you still think it's a nice Ogugua, you know that it's in there? It is now a vengeful spirit. And if she's coming for you, she's coming for both of us. Hey, Joy, you're right. See, please leave this for us, please. I, I cannot walk, you have to carry me. I have to do what? You have to carry me. I have to carry you. Yes. On your back. I'm tired. I'm tired of running. Okay. <laughs> Let me carry you. Hey! <laughs> Joy. Let's go now. My leg. I'm you are a man. You are a man. Ah. Hey, hey. I'm a man. Be a man. Oh, yeah. Ah. You'll be fast. Now. You have to ah. go this girl. Mm -hmm. Please don't kill me, I'm so sorry, please. I did not mean to murder you. I, I was just trying to, to teach you some lessons so you stay away from Kelvin. Please, please, please. Men to help me take her. Good what kind of sing will you sing in? Who are you? Kevin, time is gone. I'm your coordinator. Coordinator, there's enough time for you to start explaining yourself to me. Kevin, see, we don't have time. Just help me. Let's. We have enough time for you to explain yourself. To explain what now? What am I explaining? To explain this so you know. Know what, Kevin? Coordinator, you know. She told me that she's a priestess. Hi. Oh, go, go. See, you want to understand. It's a long story. Okay, 
This is what happened. So, what do you suggest, uncle? Hmm. We have to rescue her. We must have to rescue her. You know, I have never had a vision and it did not come to pass. And if she's not rescued, it will cause unprecedented deaths in our kingdom. Especially starting from the daughter of the late priestess. See, Uncle, I'm going back to Lagos tomorrow. So, how do we proceed? What do you actually suggest? Tomorrow it is. We have to rescue her. And we have to walk according to the dreams the gods gives to me. And after she is rescued, you take her along. So, that's what happened. After we ambushed those two men, and we pushed her. And she blacked out for two good days. Two good days. So I had to take her to the city. And I took care of her anonymously. Everything that she needed. The house, there was even a dispatch rider that I was using to give her the things that she needed. That's what happened. And everything was going fine until I don't know what entered all these girls. They just... See, the more I explain, the more dangerous it becomes. Because if she stands up from here, we are all dead. Now, see, Kelvin, there's something I want you to promise me. You have to keep this a secret. Nobody should know about this. Look, you have to promise me. Or else... Let me not threaten you, but please. Now, see. Don't worry about all these bodies. I'm going to come up with an excuse. Besides, we're in the forest. There's a disclaimer you signed in your form. That in case anything happens to you in the forest, you'll be fine. Please, just help me. Let's go, let's go. I am Kelvin. How strong. I have just witnessed the brutal deaths of my friends. I am only helping because I am scared. I must report to the police of all that has happened here. The deaths of my friends shall never go. In vain. This is only the beginning. Mm -hmm.